सो वेलकम टू ऑल सभी को नमस्ते इन दिस मॉर्निंग सेशन वी आर प्रैक्टिसिंग एक्सरसाइज टू सो लेट मी ब्रीफली समराइज ऑल दी फाइव स्टेप्स देन वी विल स्टार्ट टेकिंग ऑब्जर्वेशन सो इन दिस एक्सरसाइज टू वी आर ट्राइंग टू ऑब्जर्व द इंट्रेक्शन बिटवीन मी एंड द बॉडी तो सम एक्टिविटीज आर गोइंग ऑन इन मी एंड एक्टिविटीज आर ऑल्सो गोइंग ऑन इन द बॉडी and i have potential to observe these activities directly so if i observe myself my activities then i can say that yes i exist because i am directly observing my activities on the basis of that activities we can say that i am a unit and i exist and i am a reality because i can see myself not through eyes but through direct observation so on the basis of this direct observation i can say that i am also a reality existential reality i am a unit and i can also see activities going on in the body and based on direct observation of those activities i can also say that body exist body also exist body is also a existential reality a unit so based on this observation i can say that i am a reality where conscious activities are going on like desire thought expectation body is also a reality where physiochemical activities are taking place so i can say that the self and the body are two distinct realities and i can observe this i have potential to observe both the realities so once once i am aware that the two realities exist then we can observe the interaction between the two so in step 2 i am observing the interaction between the two and with observation i can say that the interaction between the two is taking place in the form of information so i read sensations happening in the body and this sensation is also an information i instruct to the body as and when required and this instruction is also an information so sensations are happening in the body i can read it if i think it is important but whenever i read it i may observe that these sensations are information only similarly i can instruct the body whenever i think it is important to instruct and while instructing i can see that this instruction is also an information so in step 2 i am observing the interaction between the two that is taking place in the form of information so with this step 1 and 2 i am observing in step 3 if information is taking place who is deciding body decides or i decide that i am trying to observe in this step number 3 so if i observe myself body carefully then i can see that i am the one who decides to give instruction to the body i am the one who decide to read a specific sensation from the body so many sensations are taking place but i decide which is to be read so in that sense we can say that i interact with the body as in when i required if i don't think it is important to interact with the body i keep indulging in my consciousness i keep thinking something about future something about past so this happens in me once i decide now it is important to interact with body then i take decision so i interact with the body time to time but interaction is taking place place with my decisions so i de- decide when to interact when not to interact with the body with this i am also able to see that i am seer i am doer i am enjoyer so i am seer because i have potential to observe myself my body directly in terms of activity i am doer because i decide when to interact with the body when to read information happening in the body in that sense i am doer similarly i am experiencer enjoyer because whatever decision i take in my consciousness i feel happiness or uh, unhappiness of that decision so in that sense i am seer i am doer 
एंड आई एम इंजॉयर बॉडी इज जस्ट एन इंस्ट्रूमेंट विद दिस वी आर वर्किंग ऑन स्टेप फोर वे आर वी आर ट्राइंग टू ऑब्जर्व एम आई द सेंसेशन एम आई इन दी सेंसेशन एम आई सेपरेट फ्रॉम दी सेंसेशन सो इन दिस स्टेप फोर वी आर ट्राइंग टू ऑब्जर्व दैट एज ए कॉन्शियस यूनिट आई एम नॉट द सेंसेशन आई एम सेपरेट फ्रॉम द सेंसेशन आई एम एट ए डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम दी सेंसेशन दैट्स वाई वी हैव चॉइस टू रीड द सेंसेशन और नॉट टू रीड द सेंसेशन सो इन दिस स्टेप फोर वी आर ट्राइंग टू सी अ सेपरेशन बिटवीन द टू रियालिटी देन इन स्टेप फाइव वी आर ट्राइंग टू ऑब्जर्व सेंसेशन हैपनिंग इन द बॉडी बट वी आर ट्राइंग टू आइडेंटिफाई वॉट सोर्सेस सो आई एम ट्राइंग टू सी इन स्टेप फाइव द सोर्सेस ऑफ सेंसेशन सेंसेशन दैट इज टेकिंग प्लेस इन माई बॉडी सो देर कुड बी फोर पॉसिबल सोर्सेस दैट वी आर डिस्कसिंग फॉर लास्ट फ्यू डेज एंड वी आर प्रैक्टिसिंग ऑल दिस रीडिंग आइडेंटिफाइंग सोर्सेस सो दिस वी आर डूइंग फॉर लास्ट फ्यू डेज इंट्रेक्शन बिटवीन द सेल्फ एंड द बॉडी सो इफ वी हैव फ्यू ऑब्जर्वेशन वी कैन शेयर सो वी हैव गेम बाली जी विथ एस नमस्ते भैया इन कंटिन्यूस विदेज डिस्कशन रिगार्डिंग this behavior of observed human being based on the meaning i give the their behavior i can have the sensations it is in me to have uh, good feelings or some way other other way around and uh, second thing is this uh, uh, so uh, coming to sources of this uh, sensations this uh, second one and third one are mutually interdependent because uh, for example if i do some physical exercise then even though outside environment is very cold and rainy but i feel some hot hotness in the body it's all depends on the chemical physiochemical things happen in the body and outside environment are mutually interdependent what i feel, what i observe these are the things i would like to mention and am i correct is my observations are correct i would like to know so you want clarity in step 2 and 3 you know in uh, source 2 yes, uh, and 3 these two are these two are uh, dependency is there between these two what i mean to say separately okay. we cannot uh, look into those what i mean yes so if you see the body is interacting with the environment all the time <laughs> some physiochemical activities taking place outside some physiochemical activities is taking place in the body yes and some physiochemical activities taking place in combination of both yes so for example when you touch your laptop and if laptop temperature is low for example temperature uh, laptop is cold or you can say cool yes. so when you touch this laptop so when this laptop comes in touch with your finger or hand it impacts your body so yes. if your body temperature is high and temperature of laptop is low then you will feel cold yes. right so it is happening because you have touched some outside object and there is a difference in temperature between the two on the basis of that difference you decide you know, or you are able to feel that now my hands are also cool so it is happening in combination of outside object and with my body yes this is source number 2 source number 3 is something is happening in my body for example when you take food and you over eat food then you can feel some sensations in your body like acidity and Yes. Similarly, similarly, when you are sitting for a long time, and when you get up, so you will see some sound of bones. You can observe sound of bones. Yes, yes, yeah. So it is happening within the body. Similarly, when digestion is taking place, you can feel some sensation in the body. So when yes. you eat food, and you know, immediately body start working on this food. and you feel sweating and a heat will produce in your body and you will feel sweating so it is happening with 
cause of internal activities taking place in the body but it is in combination of both but we are trying to see both the activities separately so primarily it is happening in the body yes yes like right we are yeah you see some uh, environmental conditions suppose winter summer rainy season based on the mm. seasonal conditions sometimes our body accept more and more food and digest easily sometimes our body right. only accept and digest uh, digestion is very difficult based on outside environmental condition so that's why i'm saying this combination is always there always in the sense of course these uh, situations yeah but we can see some activities happening because of internal events taking place in the body yeah. and many yeah. activities are happening because of body comes in contact with outside objects yes so both are happening so we can yeah. see yeah. and also behavior of other people it uh, all depends on uh, man, our imagination process running the way uh, that yesterday we have also discussed based on samskars we receive the way we will give the meaning of that and all those so that's why these are also somehow dependency is there what i mean to yeah but i say it again i could get you yeah uh, behavior of other human beings some mm-hmm. sensations we will have so these the meaning we will give those uh, sensations while reading is depends mm. on our imagination that also right, right. turn in turn depends on our samskars already uh, inside our samskars based on that we will give the meaning uh, mm-hmm. sometimes we feel even though other person behavior is very rude and uh, somehow they are uh, saying something opposingly even then we won't disturb at any Anyway, uh, because of our samskars so that's why i am right. saying our imaginary process and these behavior of our outside people both are also some dependency is there what they mean to so in yeah. source number 1 1 and 4 what yeah. we are saying that sounds comes to your ear but yeah. how you will read it it depends on yeah. your assumption on yes. your sanskar yes 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 so for yes. example i am sharing this exercise with you yes so what is happening my sound is reaching to your ear and you are reading this sensation if you take decision then yes. you read this sensation and when you read this sensation you read it with your sanskars yes yeah suppose another person for whom yes. you have a feeling of opposition is sharing the same steps with you and a source yes. number 1 source number 2 source number 3 at the level of body same thing will happen he will speak something sound will reach to your ear you will take decision to read that sensation but this time you will read with maybe with feeling of opposition because you have a feeling of opposition for that person so words are same process yes. at the level of body is same but i will read it with my own sanskar so i may not accept those steps with that person it may possible it is happening because of my own sanskar so i have assumed something else for one person i have assumed something else for another person that's why while reading those words i have a feeling of relationship for someone and i have a feeling of opposition for other person for the same words so it depends on our sanskar our assumption right we are yes and one more thing uh, if our assumptions uh, are based on knowing and understanding we won't have any feeling of uh, negativeness or anything am i correct yeah we yes, say it again if i understand if uh, m- if my assumptions uh, are uh, based on knowing and understanding and uh, that yes, means yes. naturally acceptable then uh, i won't have any such uh, negative feelings or uncomfortability in me in my feelings yes so this this description is right what you have described that uh, if my feelings are based on relationship harmony and coexistence uh, then i will be able to see the event as it is yes, you know? then yes. i will receive it as it is yes and yes. i will try to connect it with reality description is right whatever you are describing but the mm. issue is uh, whenever i interact it with anyone uh, am mm. i able to see what happens in me what happens in my body are we able to see it separately this we have to practice acha that is important to see yes. separately yeah. yes yes so for example if you see students of engineering college 
they yeah. talk each other with many times with abusive language yes yes but they don't react on this abusive language yes they enjoy even they enjoy this abusive language with each other yeah. but someone outside if say same words they may yeah. react on it they may start yeah. fighting on it so the yeah. words are same you know impact on yeah. body is same it is a sound only yeah. but how i read this it depends on my assumption at that time yes right so yeah. those words do not hurt me what is hurting me is my assumption yes that i have made for some person in one yes. manner for some person in another manner that is creating chaos in me right we are yeah thank you yeah all right i am able to get it yeah. how okay. to make them to see individually separately is uh, the uh, sources of senses yeah right, right. thank you thank you thank you peer so we have कपिल जी विद अस नमस्कार चंद्र जी हाँ नमस्कार गोपाल जी नमस्ते भैया और और अभी बाली जी पूछ रहे थे आई ओके होप ही इज लिसनिंग सो इट इज नॉट ए क्वेश्चन यू हैव ऑलरेडी आंसर्ड इन द सर ऑलमोस्ट ऑल द क्वेश्चंस दैट आई हैड इन माय माइंड फ्रॉम दिस सेशन टुडे एंड वेरी ब्यूटीफुली यू हैव मेंशन दैट इनसाइड समटाइम्स इफ लाइक इफ देयर इज अ यूटेंसिल और देयर इज ऑब्जेक्ट व्हिच इज कूलर इनसाइड आवर बॉडी नेम व्हिच इज हॉट वी विल टच the transfer of energy it is equilibrium everything mm-hmm. in this universe wants equilibrium that you also shared with us to nature and and existence you know everything has to be in equilibrium so that is a very wonderful example that in the you have given today uh, that was a question in my mind now bali ji i wanted to ask on lighter note if bali ji can unmute after this and ask in ramayana there was a character with the name bali so whenever bali used to go for fight against any opponent 50% of the power or energy From the opponent used to go to Bali ji. So Bali ji, जब भी किसी के सामने जाते थे युद्ध करने, उसकी 50 percent शक्ति Bali ji के पास आ जाती थी. So can these these शक्तियाँ और energy are also transferable? Is it scientific? That is what I want. Thank you. No, Bhaiya. The more important question is, do we require this for us to be in continuous happiness? So yes, I want to be in happiness in continuity. Do we require all and these things, or no, I no. have enough potential? to ensure my happiness yes. in me and i can yes, i have ensure this harmony relationship coexistence with everyone this yes. i can ensure with with my potential sure 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 so is it required to do like this that is what that is society? the question yeah, why it happened i don't know why they did it so that is what i was wondering why they did it yeah but so we may do research on it we may do research sure, on sure, it sure 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 but as for thank as you, happiness you. is concerned and we are we have enough potential to continue our yes, happiness yes we have yes sure this energy we have right we are right thank you sir. namaste bhaiya okay so we have sibir ji with us good morning sabhi ko namaskar sabhi ko namaskar namaste bhaiya uh, do do two incident very small incident just uh, i was trying to understand uh, in me just happened yesterday one one is uh, older so yesterday what happened i was standing in a queue uh, for my routine check up in all india institute of medical science so in a phase manner uh, the guard they allow people uh, to go inside for registration uh, when i reach in front of the guard just i was standing one guard came from the back side from the queue uh, for far away from the queue came in front of me and started asking the guard about how to get token there is some system to get token in the mobile itself by scanning she could not understand so she was asking how to get this token number and guard explained everything was settled she understood even after that she was standing in front of me then quietly i requested her uh, you understood then why don't you go in your own position she ignored she was uh, on the mobile itself playing something like that then again second time i requested her why don't you go in your own position why you are standing here so again she ignored she did not reply i i did not react or did not respond then i tried to see myself and i see there was a feeling of opposition there was a feeling of opposition that broken my harmony state of harmony i was not feeling very 
a state of happiness, a little bit of uh, discomfort. Then I inquired why this is happening in me, uh, because this is a outsider. But uh, the reason I find, uh, because of this uh, breaking rule, uh, which is not naturally acceptable to me, so that uh, reason, that cause, uh, caused me some sort of uh, feeling of uh, breaking of this harmony, not very uh, more or greater size. But this is, uh, I was trying to explain myself. I did not react, did not respond to anything. But still, I was trying to understand that remained for a few moments. Uh, but uh, I could not clearly uh, clarify the, uh, the reason why I, I was not comfortable that, that time. This is number one. Should I tell the next one? Yes, yes. The old incident, there was an incident of fraud case with me. It was one year, two years back with some money, about five lakhs of money. And when I remember all this, that incident, particular incident, that incident create some sort of happiness because of a loss of money. And uh, again, uh, when I inquire why why this discomfort, breaking up harmony, then I go inside and then find that the, the cause is because of that uh, losing some sort of uh, creation of facilities. What I could have done with that money like that. So that is a sort of some... Uh, loss of money and because of that what happened what uh, could not be done like that because that was not a big amount or uh, uh, that too also that may not be very much uh, so much useful but still then um, because that was a hard money so that uh, still now that is not getting it naturally accepted to me uh, because it is done by the outsider what is my assumption in me? Assumption, uh, I get, yes, uh, maybe uh, my, my uh, preconditions or maybe because of senses and loss of money like that. So this needs some clarity uh, to settle in myself, the, the reasons behind it and how to settle in me. Okay, Vaya. So it will be good if we see this event step by step. Generally, we mix many steps together. That's why I am not able to find a scope to work on ourselves. You know? So if we discuss this scenario step by step, what is happening? So for example, right. the case one, for example, the case one, you know, incident with the guard. So you are communicating something to other person so are we able to see that first we are deciding in ourselves in that sense i am doer yeah. so you must have decided to talk the other person why you are not in queue or so on but are we aware that i am doer i am taking decision to tell something to someone right so, so if i am aware yes i am doer then Am I aware that now I have taken decision, I have given instruction to my body and now my body is following. This is second level of awareness, second step of Correct. awareness. Correct. Right. Now Correct. Your, your work is over. Your work yeah. is over. You have decided in your consciousness. In that sense, you are doer. Whatever you have decided in yourself because you are experiencer also. So with the feeling in you, Either you feel unhappiness or happiness. So if you have feeling of opposition for others, then you will feel unhappiness in you. If you have a feeling of relationship for others, you will feel happy in you. So happiness or unhappiness Anna, is yeah. your decision. Because I am doer. No one is saying you to be unhappy. And other person didn't say that you become unhappy. But I am unhappy because I am doer you know? and I am yeah. seer, I am enjoyer. Right. So I have observed something in me you know, with my potential. I am taking decision and I am getting victim of this decision. Decision. So I will be okay. happy or unhappy. So this is happening in purely me, in my consciousness. Uh, Can yes, we see yes. it here? Okay. Yes. Now, is it right or not? 
still I had to explore because that outside incident is influencing rather more on me. Uh, so outside <laughs> incident is happening around you. It has some impact on your body. Now this is the role of body to communicate outside information. This is role of body. So suppose when you see that person, image comes to your uh, eyes and uh, her yeah. or his words yeah. comes to your body. This is one right. part. Now I take decision to read this only. Then you okay. read it. Once you okay. read it, now uh. what is happening in you is your decision or its decision of others. Yeah. Who has Again, decided my, my, to yeah, think yeah, like my, this? My decision. Who has ha, your decision, right? Yeah. Your decision. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And I have a feeling of opposition. It is my decision or others' decision. Um, uh, that in that particular uh, step, uh, that is uh, maybe because of our uh, habit or something <laughs> that that becomes that naturally your habit. That uh, yeah. So it yeah, is unacceptable. Yeah. You, know, uh -huh. you have as yeah. you are not accepting it. Right, so I am right, not saying right. that you accept it. Uh, you accept all right. wrong things. I, I am not saying that. What right. I am saying right. at that moment, right. you have a feeling of opposition. It is your decision or others' decision. No, no, it is yes, yes, correct. It is my decision only. Your decision because you are doer. You can decide what will happen yeah. in your consciousness. Right. right. So you have correct. decided. And once you have decided this feeling of opposition, you are becoming unhappy because you are experiencing oh, yes. also. Ah, it is clear. Yes, correct. So this I was trying to say that I am doer, I am enjoyer, and I am right. observer. See, so are doer and enjoyer. First, it must be clear to us. Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. Yes. So this clear. is first first clarity about me and about my body. Right. Right. So if mm -hmm. I am enjoyer, I am seer, I am doer. So I am getting victim of my state of consciousness. Right. Yeah. Right. This is right. happening in me. Uh -huh. yeah. So if I decide and I have decided to be in a feeling of opposition, I am experiencing its unhappiness. Then now I am analyzing things, how to react with other person. Again, you yeah. are unhappy. Now, once you mm. decide, I will say these words, this language, then you instruct your body yeah. and body doesn't have any happiness or unhappiness in it. Mm. Body will yeah. just follow your instruction. And Definitely. if you say, say this thing to that person, the body will follow it. Again, a other person will respond or not respond. Two things will happen. Yeah. In the first case, she was not responding. Yeah. So she has not responded anything and you ha you are reading it that she is not responding. How you are reading it? Because he has not given any response. Now with the eyes, you are getting information that no face expression in other person. And she is ignoring yeah. me. This mm -hmm. is happening in you. Only image is coming with your in your body. Correct. And with Correct. that image, again, you are trying to conclude something. And I have said so many words, but she is not even listening to me. How this can happen? Again, what is happening in you is your decision. You are thinking like this because you have decided to think like this. Because you yeah. are doer, so you are free inside. Yeah. You are free to think with any manner. Okay. Okay. Yes, right. Yes. Correct. And if Correct. you are free to think in any manner, then you may be happy. You are, may not be happy. Yeah. So is it yeah. okay here or not? Up to here. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. Now, now it is clear because uh, we. we we do not get into uh, step by step one another like that. So habit by habit itself, immediately uh, some sort of this thing uh, naturally acceptable, not acceptable. Then I, I started explaining it is not nat naturally acceptable. So why this is happening? Something like that. So when now uh, whatever the way you have explained. Uh, I have to go uh, explore more by step by step inside. That is yes, correct. So if you are aware that whatever yeah. the state of my consciousness, you know, whatever state in my imagination, right. then I may start thinking where is a possibility to correct or where is a possibility to take decision in right manner. Yeah. Right. So you right. will see again it, that possibility is within me. If there is yeah. a possibility, yeah. then I can change my decision. 
so i am not saying that you accept all the wrong things but what i am trying to say you can be aware of all those desire thought expectation which is going on in you and body ah. has a very certain role right body has a very certain role it is just medium of communication so if i want ah. to say something i use my body if i want to read outside environment i use my body only as a sensation ah. it is just a information so if yeah. you take yeah. role of body in this scenario so you have used your body only for a very few moment but yeah. whatever is going on in you is making you unhappy ah oh, definitely and so we should be aware the role of body uh -huh. right and the sensation happening in the body and now what mm -hmm. is happening in me this should happen uh, this should be aware right uh -huh. now yeah. if i am oh, not aware if i am not right. aware now my feelings of contradiction will impact my body and so with uh -huh. in our awareness i am damaging my body with an awareness yeah. because i i have a feeling of opposition mm -hmm. and at that time you can also observe your body what is happening in my body you will see many burning sensations heat ah uh, respiration right. rate uh, slightly uh, respiration right. rate yeah. right yeah. heartbeat uh -huh. so if you are aware all these thing then you may rethink again why i am compelled to be unhappy why am i right. am damaging my body okay okay yes so so but we mix up type... so many steps together that yeah. i am not aware that i am damaging my state of imagination i am damaging my body i am not aware very correct the similar things happen uh, many things many incidents create psychosomatic disease in the body something like that i i i believe right so psychosomatic disease means i have some problem in yeah. me some feelings which is not naturally acceptable to me yeah. because of that feeling i am becoming unhappy and with that unhappiness yeah it impacts my body also so body is getting diseased because it is a material yeah. it has some limits yeah. uh -huh. and uh -huh. with this feeling of contradiction i unnecessarily instruct my body correct to be taken yeah i am not able to do anything outside but what i am doing is i am making myself happy i am damaging my body also uh, the damaging my body that is more important yeah very correct absolutely so correct. if we are aware all these thing then we can make ourselves settled then we may respond outside right. Right. but but we miss all these things all these steps uh, uh, in between the steps uh, to to go inside uh, to, this is an making by me yeah correct right so observe it again whenever you see yeah. such scenario you yeah, know right right then right, right. then we will see uh, when we move further then we will see how to handle all those thing in me right. what is right. happening correct. in me but correct. 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 we should be aware what is happening step by step right right right, right bhaiya hmm. okay 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 bhaiya okay. namaste bhaiya namaste namaste sabhi ko namaste namaste okay so if anyone has observation we can share it otherwise we will practice uh, this exercise and uh, these steps for some time for 5 minute for 10 minutes then we can take your observation again so from tomorrow onwards we will discuss it in more depth you know, how to handle my sanskar at in this type of scenario what bhaiya was describing it so we will discuss it but awareness should be there step by yeah. step awareness should be there right so let's take pause for 5 to 6 minute and in this 5 to 6 minute we is we will observe ourselves body what is happening in uh, between the two then we will try to find out the source we will try to find out what is happening in me what is happening in body when i am taking decision to read the sensation when i read the sensation what happens in me all these things we will observe in the next you know 5 to 6 minute and the more sharply we observe the interaction between the two then we will able to figure it out where is the possibility to change my decision where is the possibility to correct my sanskar then we will see it and it is very important to observe the body the self my decisions and the interaction between the two then we will be able to see that body has a very certain role 
मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम वी आर गेटिंग विक्टिम ऑफ माई डिसीजन बिकॉज आई एम डूअर आई कैन डिसाइड एनी थिंग इन मी इट मे बी बेस्ड ऑन एजम्पन और इट मे बी बेस्ड ऑन नोइंग सो स्लोली वी विल मूव वॉट इज द बेसिस ऑफ नोइंग वॉट विल हैपन इन मी इफ आई डिसाइड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ नोइंग दैट वी विल सी इट बट इन नेक्स्ट फाइव मिनट नेक्स्ट फाइव मिनट्स वी विल ऑब्जर्व I will observe. I am seer. I am doer. I am enjoyer. I am observing myself. I am observing my body. With awareness, I will see when I take decision to interact with body. With awareness, we I will try to see when I take decision to read any sensation. And once I read that sensation, what happens in me? This we will try to observe in next five minutes. Right. So I am. muting my mic for 5 minutes we will do this exercise sit comfortably honestly lose your body and just observe for next 5 minutes
ओके लेट कम बैक है ना सो आई होप यू हैव ऑब्जर्व योर सेल्फ यू आर एबल टू सी दैट यू आर सी आर डूअर एंड एंजॉयर एंड यू हैव ऑब्जर्व योर बॉडी यू हैव ऑब्जर्व द इंट्रैक्शन बिटवीन द टू है ना एंड वेन यू आर ऑब्जर्विंग ऑल दिस थिंग्स आई होप यू आर अवेयर सो दिस वी हैव टू कीप एक्सरसाइजिंग ऑल द डे मैनी इवेंट्स आर टेकिंग प्लेस है ना मैनी इंट्रैक्शन आर टेकिंग प्लेस मैनी एक्टिविटीज आर टेकिंग प्लेस इन माई बॉडी आउटसाइड समथिंग स्टार्ट इन माई इमेजिनेशन इट इम्पेक्ट्स माई बॉडी सो फर्स्ट इज ऑल आर वी अवेयर ऑल ऑफ दीज थिंग्स सो वंस वी आर अवेयर यू विल सी दैट मैनी टाइम्स यू विल बी एबल टू इंटरप्ट योर सेल्फ विथ द अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ रियलिटी बट इफ यू आर नॉट अवेयर ऑफ दीज स्टेप्स एंड वी आर ऑफ सींग आउटसाइड इन्वायरमेंट माई सेल्फ विथ मैनी स्टेप्स टूगेदर देन इट विल बी डिफिकल्ट टू फाइंड अ स्कोप टू इंटरप्ट माई सेल्फ विथ द क्लैरिटी ऑफ हारमोनी रिलेशनशिप रिलेशनशिप एंड को एग्जिस्टेंस सो दैट्स वाई दिस अवेयरनेस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट सो वी कैन टेक वन शेयरिंग ओनली बिकॉज इट्स फाइव मिनट्स लेफ्ट सो नीतू जी बीत नमस्ते दीदी नमस्ते टू ऑल एम आई ऑडिबल भैया जी 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 भैया आई हैव एन ऑब्जर्वेशन टू शेयर हेयर वेन आई वॉज ऑब्जर्विंग Uh, first i was aware no i had my close eyes closed today so i could mm-hmm. see the behavior of other human being in the past is also affecting me it is going on mm-hmm. as imagination in me and uh, some random incident if it is two or three incidents i could imagine i could see in my imagination the incident which was not giving me good feeling i brushed it aside and uh, i you know, flowed with my thought somewhere else and the second incident that i recalled it was favorable to me and i was feeling good about it and at that time i could also feel my heart beat it is there but mm. at that time when i was feeling happy with that imagination i was ha- having this sensation in my heart which was quite you know prominent and i could feel it so, and the fan was also there there was air in my hair but it was not important for me but yes i could feel so i could see that how i am giving importance to my imagination and then i am giving importance to my heartbeat and the fan and the air are at the last last number so this is my observation bhaiya yes didi so very nice observation didi hai na and it is good that we all are observing step by step hai na we are we all are able to find out the sources of sensations hai na it is good didi so if i know the sources of sensation then i will be able to decide where to work so suppose yes yes bhaiya if i know that sensation is taking place in my body because of some issues my imagination now i can decide i have to work my on my imagination not on the body yes 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 bhaiya right didi if i am aware that sensation is taking place because of outside environment then i can work on it whether i have to work on outside environment or or i have to take decision for my body right something is yes. taking place within my body some burning sensation etc then i can decide i have to make a right program for the body it is not happening because of my imagination so i can make right program for the body next time i skip my food next time i take healthy food hai na so clarity is required ji bhaiya hai na that's why i am trying to repeat all these step hai na again and again so that we may get aware of the sources and once i am aware of the sources then i can take a fine decision where to work yes bhaiya yes suppose i am not aware that the sensation is taking place in my body because of certain issues of my imagination then i will be confused yes bhaiya and i will not be able to take right decision problem in my imagination and i will try to do something for body now Ji. it will not work yes yes bhaiya knowing all these so four sources why... is very important yeah right right so it is nice sharing didi good that you are able to observe <laughs> and the sources very nice didi thank you didi thank you bhaiya thank you all okay so now it's time for hindi session
है ना दो देर आर हैंड रेस्ट ऑफ चंद्रशेखर जी एंड राजेश शर्मा जी सो वी कैन टेक शेयरिंग टुमारो नाउ आई रिक्वेस्ट तारा प्रसन्ना भैया है ना टू स्टार्ट हिंदी सेशन एंड कंक्लूड दिस इंग्लिश सेशन एंड बिफोर तारा भैया स्टार्ट आई विल रिक्वेस्ट ईच वन ऑफ अस टू बी मोर अवेयर ऑफ दिस सोर्सेस टू बी मोर अवेयर वॉट इज हैपनिंग इन माई बॉडी वॉट इज हैपनिंग इन मी whatever is happening in me because of outside going on something or whatever is happening in my body because of something in me happening we should be clear about all these things then we will be able to take right decision for us right ji bhaiya tarah prashna bhaiya thank you so much mukul uh, bhaiya for putting all these points so minutely and definitely it is helpful for all of us in our exploration So with this, we may thank once again everyone for being a part of this English part of the morning session. 